my dear officers i am happy to join you again at a conference like this after nearly 2 years let me place on record my appreciation of the efforts put in by the collectors joint collectors and others in solving the problems of the people in ensuring effective implementation of the various schemes policies and programs undertaken by the state government para i am glad that the district administrators heads of departments and senior officials in the government have met here again to discuss the important problems facing the state and to set new goals in various activities and developmental programs i would like you to discuss all the issues and come up with amicable solutions i am happy to a large extent we have succeeded in translating into action most of the decisions taken in the last conference i congratulate everybody for this para however i would like to tell that we all know no functionary above or below the district collector enjoys such an enviable status including the other district officers this is because of the faith that governments have placed in this institution however i would like to caution some of the district officials including collectors on the need to maintain good public relations with people's representatives the collectors must realize that the non officials have an important role to play in democracy para the collectors must therefore carry the non official machinery along with them this will enable the collectors to discharge their functions in a more effective manner it must be realized that once the non official or a minister finds the collector receptive to his suggestions he will assist the district administration in the better way of implementing the policies and programs of the government that were announced from time to time by the government i draw your attention in particular to the need to provide drinking water ensuring efficient functioning of fair price shops cooperative and commercial banks the primary health centers hospitals and the primary and secondary schools along with this we should ensure success of programs uppermost in the minds of the government like implementation of ban on arac efficient conduct of important programs like the total literacy program the finally planning program which are 
aimed at the uplift men of the poor and the needy with particular emphasis on women finally i would like to congratulate all district officials including collectors for their cooperation pyara dear sir in reply to your better we are sorry to inform you that we are unable to give special tariff for the chairs indicated in your letter we shall be happy to supply you at the ordinary rates if you give your confirmed order the chairs are of the best quality and let us have an order for these chairs so that we can make necessary arrangements to deliver the goods as per your order pyara ladies and gentlemen i am happy to join you again at a conference like this after nearly one and half years at the outset let me place on record my appreciation of the efforts put in by the collectors and others in solving the problems of the people and in ensuring effective implementation of the various schemes and policies undertaken by the state government i am glad that the district officers heads of department and senior officers in the government have met from time to time here again to discuss the important problems facing the state and to set new goals in various activities and developmental programs para i would like to discuss all the issues and come up with solutions i am happy that to a large extent we have succeeded in translating into action most of the decisions taken in the last conference i thank everybody for this our needs are many the aspirations of the people are large and we have high ambitions too i hope and trust that all of you to continue to act not merely as the eyes and ears of the government but as agents of change a change for the betterment and welfare of the people particularly weaker sections of the society para in this connection i need hardly remind you that the institutions of the district collector has maintained a unique character in our state i wonder if i would be overvalued if i were to say that such an extraordinary combination of functions responsibilities and authority cannot be found anywhere in the country even within our own state we all know that no functionary above or below the district collector enjoys such a pride status including the other district officers this is largely because of the faith that the governments have placed in this institution however i would like to add a word of caution to some of the collectors on the need to maintain 
good public relations with people's representative para the collectors must realize that the non officials have an important role to play in the parliamentary democracy the collectors must therefore carry the non officials along with them this will enable the collectors to discharge their functions in a more effective manner it must be realized that once the non official finds the collector receptive to his suggestions he will assist the district administration in the better implementation of the policies and program para dear sirs we wish to introduce ourselves as one of the leading manufacturers of four wheelers we are having our authorized dealers in all the important cities and towns throughout the country in this connection we wish to bring to the notice of all our customers that shortly we are introducing into the market a new car suitable for long distance travel coupled with comfort para the other technical details will be published shortly in all the newspapers for public information we have got all the clearances from the government of india and the concerned state governments in fact we have received appreciation letter from government of india for introducing such a kind of cars to the public which is cost effective in this connection we wish to inform our customers that since it is a product which is being released on the occasion of silver jubilee celebration of our company we want to extend credit facility yours faithfully